Hey, I'm Craig from ITC Reef Culture, and I'm going to give you a really good run through of Parwise, how to use it, what it's for, and all of the functions that we've got. So, the first thing you need to do is plug it into your device. Parwise will work on a Mac, a PC, any Android tablet or phone, as long as it's a fairly modern one. Um, unfortunately, it doesn't work on iPad or iOS, but as soon as Apple turn that on, perhaps they will. Um, it's definitely a, it's an us. Uh, sorry, it's a them, not an us thing. So all you need to do is plug it into one of the ports on your device. So I'm plugging it in on USB-C over here. We do include a USB-C adapter, not just this one. This one's just specifically for this tablet. But you plug it in, you hit connect, and off you go. Depending on your device, it will depend whether you need to put the web address in, which is par-wise.com. Uh, uh, then uh, the app is a web app, and it will download and install into your browser. Um, once it's done it the first time, you'll never have to do it again. Um, and it'll work offline, so you don't need to be connected to the internet. So once you're plugged in, you'll be uh, faced with the dashboard, and you've got all of your main lighting parameters across the top. So par, correlated color temperature, lux, peak wavelength, the approximate color, and DLI. Um, when you see the coral here, we're viewing in uh, underwater mode for freshwater and for marine. If you hit this button down here, this turns the calibration into in-air mode. So if you're into hydroponically growing fruits and vegetables or want to check out whatever the light is for your orchids, you've got an air measurement mode as well. So it's not just an underwater meter. It is fully submersible and you can put it up to uh, eight feet into your uh, water. Uh, that's how long the cable is. Um, so yeah, I'm going to leave it in uh, underwater mode for this demo. So the first thing, you've got all of your main light parameters. but this is more than just a par meter. You can measure spectrum as well, which is part of the special magic of this product. So you can check out the entire spectral uh, output of your, your aquarium light and tune the lights to get the most out of what, what lighting you have. So under the lights that we're in here, there's a really big peak of uh, green and yellow. That's no good really for plants and corals, but it's great for human vision, which is why the lights are so, uh, so yellow. Interestingly, if I pop this little orange uh, coral viewing lens on, you can see it cuts out all of the blue light and you get the approximate color of the lens as well shown on the screen. Uh, and now the peak wavelength is 600 nanometers. So uh, just sort of showing you how responsive it is in real time. We've got a, a UV uh, black light here, which is 380 nanometers. You can't really see the light, but if I shine it at the Parwise sensor, you can see that it really over dominates uh, the, the, the light. The spectral readout here is the approximate, uh, sorry, is the uh, relative intensity. So that's now flooding the sensor with uh, black light. But we don't get a huge amount of par because only a small amount of it falls above 400. And um, par wise is, is awesome in that because it's a digital sensor, we can ignore all of the light under 400 nanometers, which practically no other light meter out there, as far as I'm aware, can selectively ignore that. So some light meters do over inflate if your aquarium lights are uh, getting any of this light. So lighting your tank is, you've got three main parts to it. You've got peak par, which is a snapshot of the maximum light level at that point in time, which is great to know. But what's perhaps more important is the DLI. Now DLI is daily light integral, which is the amount of light that you put into the aquarium over 24 hours. So if you think about it, all of the food that we eat in the day, it gives us the energy. This is the total amount of energy that you've put into the aquarium in 24 hours, which is a much more relevant uh, reading to have than just the peak par that you're getting at the moment. So the full lighting recipe is peak par, spectrum, and DLI, and that is the three parts to get in a really successful aquarium light setup in your tank. So get your par wise every time you get a new coral, measure where you're going to put it and then you're good to go. Our products are distributed in the US by Coral View and they're available from all of the big outlets but we always say ask your local retailer, support your local retail store and see if they can get it in for you. Thank you.